Hello everybody. Okay, I'm going to start packing very soon. I have been working on clearing up my acne scars and I feel like it's looking so much better. If you guys can see, I'm very happy with what's going on currently. Uh, Luna has her toy over here. She's right behind me. So if they're squeaking, that's what that's from. Yesterday I went to Sephora. If you guys missed that vlog, feel free to go check it out. It's the last one. I met up with Steph and we did like a little lunchy shopping day and I wanted to do a haul of the stuff that I grabbed, but because my skin is a little bit dry right now, I want to do a little face mask simultaneously. So I'm going to do which one should I do that won't make me look super crazy as I do this haul? We've got the animal ones, and I feel like that'll look a little silly. I'll do this aloe vera one. I feel like this will be good. Oh, soothing, moisture, and brightening. Perfect. That's great for what's going on right now. It's like very minimal. You can't even see it, but you can really feel just like a little bit more dryness than usual. And I am an oily girl, so I'm not used to having dry skin. Oh my God, look how juicy. This is from the Crumb Shop, by the way. I love their face masks. They're pretty much the only ones that I use. Oh, it smells so nice like a spa. Oh, it feels so nice on the skin. Fix this little eye hole. There we go. <laughs> All right. I'm going to leave this on the skin as I do my little haul for you guys. And then I'll be ready to pack. I'm essentially just going to show you all the stuff that I grabbed. And most of it is just travel things and then throw it immediately into my little cosmetic bag. So here we go. Okay. Extra and rub on the arms. I got two little bags. I got this one and then this bag. This one did break though. So I'll start with this one. First up, as I said, I got mostly just like little travel things. I bought a bunch of just little minis to bring on this trip. And then when when I'm back home, I throw them in a specific drawer. And then on next trips, I just pull them all out again until I use them up and need to replenish. So I've got here the Orbe Dry Texturizing Spray. I love these minis, but they obviously go pretty quickly, but they're fabulous. I got the Orbe Dry Texturizing Spray. I got the Living Proof Flex Hairspray. I love this so much. I meant to get a little mini dry shampoo from Living Proof too, but I accidentally got it mixed up with this one, which I still like this product a lot, but I thought it was the dry shampoo. This is the Full Dry Volume and Texture Spray. I do love this stuff. I got a shampoo and conditioner, little mini Olaplex ones. I love these shampoo and conditioners. They're fantastic. And then I got a little mini beauty blender cleanser because I love these so much. I'll bring these with me whenever I travel and it just gets your beauty blender or your sponge so, so clean. And having a clean beauty blender helps prevent breakouts and bacteria and everything like that. So very important for me to have that. I also got a new shampoo and conditioner. I love this brand so much. I've yet to try this line. Right now I'm using the blue one, which I think is like a hydro, like like, you know, moisture shampoo and conditioner. These are called the Cure. So these are the bond repair. So they're for dry, you know, broken hair. And I'm always trying to add moisture back to my hair, especially from like coloring and getting it to grow and all those sorts of things. But this is from the brand Amika. I love their shampoo that I have tried so far and their conditioner. And I love their detangler. I use that every time I'm out of the shower and I wanted to give these a try. So I grabbed those. And then in this bag, just some more little minis. First up for my little uh, perks, they had a really good set this month. This is the Sol de Janeiro the little babies of their little body creams, which are fantastic. I love them. Honestly, I thought this was a really good little point perk. These are great to throw in your car, in your purse, in your travel bag, whatever it may be. So you got three of those. I'll definitely use those all summer long. You were just loving that little lamb chop. I got a new little mini Tatcha. This is their water cream and their face wash. The Deep Cleanse, one of my favorite cleansers ever. I also love the little moisturizer that it comes with. I'm really not too picky with like cleansers and moisturizers. As long as it's like a gel base, I love it. Oh my God, I'm so excited. I've been wanting to buy this online for so long, but it's always sold out. So when I saw it in the store, I got so excited. And obviously I'm excited because it's a NARS product, but this is their Manoy Body Glow. If you guys have not ever seen this, it is absolutely fantastic. It's a bronzy body glow for the summer. Or if you know, you have like a nice event, you want to look bronzed and sun-kissed and gorgeous. This is the best I've ever tried. It's not greasy. It's not sticky. It is always sold out. So when I saw it in the store, I got very excited. You just pull the little top off like this. It smells like summer in a bottle and I am so excited to finally have it. Alicia is always the one that has it and I always steal hers. So finally I can share and give her some back because it's amazing. Other little things. Oh, I got these little Sephora eye patches because they just looked cute and I thought I would bring those. I got a mini of the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Setting Spray. This stuff is my absolute favorite. You spray it before you do your makeup, you spray it after and I swear your makeup will not move. I have the full size over here. I'm going through this one currently as we speak. And I had another little mini one and I tried to actually pour this one into the mini one yesterday, but the sprayer was broken. So I ended up just getting another little mini one. And then hopefully I can just keep reusing these two now, but I love it. It's an amazing setting spray. I got a little mini makeup cleansing balm. This is the pharmacy one because I needed a new one. I ran out of my last one. Oh, I, I never told you guys, I used the one that I got from Japan. If 
you guys remember. I ran out of my little baby cleansing balm there, so I bought one in Japan, and I got that one that was hot. It ended up being like a menthol-y feel and burnt my skin, so I am not able to use that one anymore. So I got this one to travel with and use, which I have used this one before. It's great, doesn't burn the skin. And last but not least, I actually ended up buying one of these little like medium-sized guys. Here's a little size reference. This is the Sol de Janeiro Rio Radiance Cream. I love this one so much. I have the big daddy one behind the camera. This one's fantastic. And I figured this size would be perfect to travel with because I'm gonna go through this very quickly if I bring just this on a week-long trip. So this is perfect. I'm gonna bring this guy. It's gonna be amazing. And that is everything that I picked up, all my travel stuff. Again, I'm just gonna literally like right into a bag and let's start packing. Time to stuff the suitcase. Hello, Luna. Also, I bought a pack of packing cubes. I'm gonna use packing cubes. I don't know if it's my first time, but I haven't used them in like years if so. I'll link these down below. They were some of the more inexpensive ones that I could find on Amazon, but especially with this being like a summery trip, you know, most of the clothes are like billowy, like bathing suits or dresses or something. So I figured it'd be good to try these to try and like compress and consolidate. You know, it's not like I'm bringing like winter coats or anything, but it was a pack of like eight of them. I've got different varying sizes. And then there's also a dirty laundry bag too, which I really liked. So I'm gonna try. I am just quickly coming on to tell you that packing cubes are the best things I've ever used and I cannot believe I haven't used them. These are all my clothes for the trip. These are like matching sets, dresses, and then bathing suits. And I still need to do like pajamas and, oh, I need to pack my like workout clothes too. Normally this would have taken up the whole side and half of that side over there. And this is crazy. Cannot recommend these enough. Hello guys. Okay, we have been scrambling. We had like all day, but it just took so long to get everything together. We have everything packed. The last thing I need to do is water the garden and then we are on the way. I am a sweaty Betty mess and I'm wearing a sweatsuit and it's hot. I'm gonna water the garden though. <laughs> Woo! Just a quick little hose down before we go. Also my cilantro bolted, that's why there's nothing here. And like, what is that, like a couple weeks? I don't know what happened. It did not do well. Everything else though is looking Gorgeous. We made it to the airport, guys. I took a nap the entire ride over and we are here. I've never felt so like late for a trip, but I do see some friends up above. Hi! She did her makeup so she gets through this no, time. I literally she had the last dinner. Hi, Dee! <laughs> you look gorgeous. Oh my God, look at this. Do you want the, wait, do you want the warm? Do you want the cool? I'm you more of a cool, I think. Thank Both you. Both are very cool. Little update, I don't know if Cal and I are gonna make it on this plane because we are on standby and we're waiting and they oversold I'm the gonna flight. I'm fucking scream. I'm screaming on the inside. I just, I said, oh sorry. <laughs> no, please, go ahead. I was just gonna say, I said that I would go up there and I would give her my ring, the one that she gave me in Hawaii, and I'd be like, oh my God, they're literally just, they're going on their honeymoon, like you are not about to let this happen. <laughs> it actually looks so bad. Whatever's gonna happen is gonna happen, but I am missing twice right now. And that's, I think, okay. what I'm most sad about. God never puts you through things you can't handle. I think twice is on the plane right now. You're right. I was thinking, I was actually, while we were walking through, and I was thinking I might not make it on the plane, twice walked these halls yesterday. So, <laughs> it's true. So it's they okay. did, they landed. We're, we're gonna be okay. So, we're just praying, and updates to come. <laughs> Alicia and Ollie were so sweet, and they were waiting with us, and we were like, go to the lounge. You have to go experience the lounge. That's yeah. the coolest part. Little backstory. So, twice is performing in LA tonight. I had tickets to go. I was so excited, but then, obviously, the flight came up, so I wasn't able to go. I'm so sad to miss them, but obviously this is still a really cool opportunity. I'm spinning because I'm so excited and nervous that we're not gonna make it on the flight. If we don't make it on this flight, Cal and I have already decided we're gonna buy last minute nosebleeds. Yes. We're close to SoFi right now and we will be going. We will we're go. gonna drop our luggage off at my aunt's house and we're gonna go and I'm gonna go dress like this and I couldn't be happier about it. So yeah. updates to come. Thank you, mm -hmm. babe, for the support. Of course. Which Twice song are you most excited to see? You know your favorite. I don't remember. You know the your feels? favorite. Yeah. Is that a song? He likes the feels. We oh, made it! it. We did it. I just have to say, they were being a bitch to you. And I know you, you would never, no, so you would never say it. So I'm gonna say it. Also my side part, what? <laughs> we made it. Cheers. Cheers to that. I went to the gift shop and frantically bought so many things because I had about 30 seconds and just threw things into the bag. So we'll do a little haul of everything that I got. We got waters, a water for you, sir. I got salt and vinegar pistachios. I got cookies, no cream, chocolate, oat milk almonds. These little passion fruit gummies. We got mango, dried mango. I got these for Cal, chocolate pretzels. Of course. And I also got Cal these white cheddar cheeses Amazing. and i got little birthday cake cookies and 
blueberry muffin cookies. These are like keto, low carb cookie things. They're really good. We got a full menu and a pen so we can like fill out what we want. This is so exciting. I'll do a TikTok on what I eat on the plane. This is gonna be fun. Dinner has arrived. We got some shrimp and some steak, some bread, cheese. This looks amazing. We landed safely in Switzerland. We're now here for like a couple hours and then we're jumping on another plane that is taking us to Italy. But I'm sweaty and I need a drink. Look at all these pastries they have here that are different. They've got a smoothie blueberry donut, a vanilla donut. Change of plans, I'm getting a little breakfast thing here to just grab and go. What is this? This looks good. Granola, mango, yeah. That sounds delicious. Look at all these sandwiches. Okay guys, we've made it to the airport, as you saw, airport hall. I got this, I'm not sure what this is. I think it's tea, but I'm not tea. sure. It looks delicious though, a tea. I got these chocolate rice cakes, ooh la la. And I got this banana mango situation. What'd you get, airport hall? Beer. <laughs> An airport beer. All right guys, transferring to our second flight. This is so cool. We're just, oh, there's stairs, damn it. We're yes. walking on, is he here? Oh, he's here. Ollie got separated from us on the first first little bus, so I think he's pulling up now, and we're going. It is so beautiful well, here. Okay. We made it! Yeah. Oh my goodness, what a beautiful airport. Yay! We are in Puglia. Hashtag, we are in Puglia. Hello everyone, we've officially made it into the hotel. You get a little glimpse behind me, but it is the most stunning hotel I've ever seen in my life. I'm gonna wait till it's light tomorrow in the next vlog to do like a full in-depth tour, but you're gonna be mind blown, right babe? Right, California. for real, it's so nice. He's holding my light for me. We're having some food we ordered. I got the kids pasta with the baby meatballs. Oh. The kids pasta? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Even a plain meatball's good already. <laughs> Let me show you. Also, I obviously got in and immediately showered because that was a long travel day and I was sweaty and gross. I did not realize the food was gonna be this big, but we got the filet with some roasted veggies on the side. I had to try the pasta. Fun fact about me, I'm not the biggest marinara fan or like a tomato sauce fan. So Cal got the orecchiette with the tomato sauce. I got it plain and the meatballs apparently came on the side. I would like to try my first bite of Italian pasta. I've waited my whole life for this. Granted, I know it is plain and I know it would be better with sauce, but still, I must try on camera. Oh my god, it's already so good. Can I film you, baby? Sure. I have to get you having your first bite of Italian I don't pasta. It looks very good. No, it's so good. No, I don't look very good. Oh, you don't look You look great. Also, we just got through like a 24 hour travel day. Wow, that pasta was so good. <gasps> oh my gosh. You gotta get the Parmesan. I know. I just love pasta. I can't believe we're eating pasta in Italy. This is crazy. Yeah? That was really cool. Hell yeah. <laughs> Hello guys, dinner was absolutely amazing. The pasta had olive oil on it, so it was just like a very simple pasta that was delicious, and I, it was just so good. I'm now going upstairs. I'll give you the full in-depth hotel villa tour tomorrow, but right now the lighting is not fantastic, but I'll give you some sneak peeks right now. Cal does not want to be on camera with his face, but he's wearing his robe, and he's got a face mask on. He's living the luxe life already. We've got the TV on. I already unpacked. I've got all all of my little, uh, like my makeup and things over here. NAR set out some products already, which I'm so excited about. We have some lipsticks over here. These are the Afterglow Sensual Shine lipsticks, so I cannot wait to try those. This is like my little tech bag. I've got all of my chargers and things in here. I've got makeup and accessories right there for the actual drawers. Up in the top here, I've got all of my underwear. I brought this for TK. We've got underwear, bathing suits, accessories, workout clothes, and then in this one, I've got all of my little sets and all my jeans and all my little just like cute like maxi dresses that are nice and stretchy and easy to be rolled up. That's my two drawers and then over in the closet over here. I put your shoes down here, babe, by the way, in case you were wondering where they were. I put Cal's shoes down here for him. He has a couple things hung up. And then this is my stuff. I've got my purse here, all of my longer, nicer dresses, some little sweaters, and then more purses and accessories down there. I know my hair looks like Hagrid right now. We're gonna fix that, but I was trying to figure out what to prop you guys up on, but I realized in my big tech bag, I brought this new tripod that I've yet to try, so hopefully this works, but I believe I can prop the camera up on this. I'll link this down below. I'm always trying new tech products, and I know a lot of you guys are like vloggers and probably TikTokers, 
frozen things too. So if you guys ever want product recommendations, anything that I like, I'll link down below. Okay, this is sweet. We open it like that. Oh, this is cool. Okay, let me try and whoa put you guys on this one second whoa okay this one's cool because it's not only one that you can put your camera on but you can also put your phone on that and it's like mega tall that's very cool all right you guys are balancing on the sink i've also got my favorite little clip on light which i will also link down below for you guys if you want this as well but this thing is a game changer if you make any sort of content but welcome to the bathroom this is a Stunning bathroom, it's so beautiful. All the stone and it's so soft on my feet, but I wanna get ready for bed. I'm so energetic right now and it's midnight. So hopefully I sleep soon. But as I was telling you guys earlier, I love this Amica Hydro Rush. This is the Intense Moisture Leave-In Conditioner. So I brought this with me. My hair looks, as I said, very much like Hagrid because I started using these things, which I've only used it twice, but I am so obsessed with it that I brought it here. And oh my goodness, you guys. I mean, this is not rocket science. This is not a new product by any means, but it's newer to me. It's just a microfiber towel that you can use to Oh no, the light died. Let me get my back up. I'm back. I got light number two. I'm always prepared. <laughs> yes, as I was saying, this thing is fantastic. I mean, you could go to Home Goods and buy them TJ Maxx, Ross, wherever, Target, Walmart. I bought mine on Amazon, so I'll link them down below too. It's significantly heavier than it is when it's dry, obviously, but that means that it sopped up a lot of the water from my hair. I mean, I washed my hair like probably like 45 minutes ago, and I have a lot of hair, a lot of extensions, and my hair takes forever to dry. And for it to dry this quickly with this. This and air is amazing. So it's really easy and cool. I'm sure we all know, but you have like the little hood part and you flip your head over and then you take the hood, you put it over your head like this, you line up your hair and then you twist, twist, twist. And I've done this with my regular bath towel since I was younger. Oh my God, of course I did it badly on camera. And then you pull it back and then you button it back here with the little elastic around the button. And it looks crazy because again, my hair is pretty much almost dry, but when it's wet, it stays up there. It sops all the water up. And I've always done this with a towel growing up ever since I was a kid, just like with a normal bath towel, but this just absorbs so much better. And I got a three pack of them and it's my new favorite thing. You will never catch me now with wet hair without one of these in. I'm just letting that dry. But as I was saying, love this detangler. I spray it all around and then we gently brush through. Hair is nice and soft. I'll go in with some more products also normally, but I didn't travel with all of them. I figured at least this was just good to bring. I'm gonna put it back in my little beauty section over here and I'm gonna do my nighttime skincare routine. Figured I would share that with you guys. Don't need this. All right, I'm gonna do my nighttime skincare routine. Also, the NARS team put some products here in the bathroom. We've got some NARS skin serum. We've got, ooh, a treatment lotion. I'm gonna try this tonight. We've got <gasps> their moisturizer, which is in a really pretty cup. This reminds me of like when they serve you beer at some like traditional Japanese restaurants in those little wooden boxes. And then we've got, ooh, eye and lash gel. I'm gonna use this too. Okay, let's try some of these products out and I'll show you guys what I've been using. cal has got his very intensive skincare routine. He takes very good care of skin. Let's begin my cleansing. As you guys saw earlier, I just brought this little Tatcha one. So I'm going to cleanse my skin. Glasses are coming off, so I can't really see a ton to be honest, but I'm going to clip my hair back with my little Daiso hair clips. Love these guys. Ooh. Jeez, I told you I can't really see much. Okay, that's good. Now time to cleanse. Gotta open her up. All right, a little bit of this and I'm going to cleanse with warm water. BRB. All right, cleansed and patting dry. Okay, love it. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with my serum. I've been using this Osmosis MD Stem Factor. I got this from my facialist, but I just do a pump. Put this more so on my cheeks. Again, as I told you guys, I've been really trying to lighten my acne scars. And I feel like it's looking much better better. I'm just someone who likes to pick my skin, which I know is so bad. Then I'm going to do moisturizer and I brought the little Tatcha one as you guys saw, but this one's here. So let's try this NARS Skin Light Reflecting Moisturizer. I love the packaging and I love their light reflecting makeup line. It's a gel base. It looks like, like a gel cream, very similar to the Tatcha one. Mm, doesn't have a scent. I'm going to put that on the skin. Wow. I love this packaging. Oh, I should have done toner, but I forgot. I'm just going to skip that. We're just going to put the moisturizer on. Okay. It feels really nice on the skin. Wow. I like to put the moisturizer down on my neck. Wow. That feels really good. Okay. Then next up, as of yesterday, I started working in eye cream. I got this one in a PR package. This is from Tatcha. This is the Silk Peony Melting Eye Cream. I got this from MEJ. So thank you so much to them. But I'm going to try the NARS one because again, why not? Oh, okay. This is also like a gel cream base. Normally they're, I feel like very just like cream. I like that. All right. Tap, tap, tap. 
tapping under the eye. I know we use our ring finger because it's gentle. Ooh, it smells good. Okay, that feels great. Last but not least, I've been using this product here. I use this every other night. This is from Jan Marini. It's the Age Intervention Duality. So basically it's an adult acne treatment cream and anti-aging complex. Basically, it's like two pumps in one and you go like this. Hold on, let me clean my hands. You put two fingers on the pumps and then you pump down at the same time. Uh-oh, I only got one. You get two pumps, one's yellow, one's white. One is a benzoyl peroxide treatment. So that helps with preventing acne because I'm just very acne prone and I have very acne prone skin and I just take a little because this stuff is strong. And then I mostly just put it on my cheeks because I'm very prone to cheek acne. So I just kind of tap that in a little on my chin, a little around my nose, but mostly on the cheeks. And this has already been helping me keep my acne at bay. And I really like it so far. I will say it's very drying. So I've been needing to moisturize more frequently because of it, but it's been really working for my skin. So if you guys also suffer from adult acne, then I recommend checking that out. I'll link everything down below for you guys that I can find. I will say a lot of the products are definitely pricier, but I've seen such an improvement in my skin. Okay, glasses going back on so I can see. All right, guys, on that note, I am going to go to bed. Hopefully soon I'm gonna read, go to bed. I've been reading this book called, I think it's called Icebreakers on my Kindle, and it's really good. If you're looking for a good smut recommendation. I recommend that one. So yes, I'm gonna go to bed. Today was a really crazy travel day, but I'm so excited for this trip. Be sure to come back to the next vlog if you guys want to see like the full hotel tour and what we get into on this trip. Tomorrow we're going on a boat, which I cannot wait. Sometimes I get a little seasick, so everybody, fingers crossed, I'll be good, and I will see you guys in the next one. Love you. Bye!